back to my channel. So for today's vlog, I'll be doing one of the most requested videos, makeup video tutorials from my friends, and that is the graduation makeup look. So guys, I know that it's graduation day, na, aside from prom, I'll be doing some makeup tutorial set about the prom makeup or graduation ball makeup. But for today, I'll be doing the graduation day look. So, um, kay ba manjug ko nga mostly yun sa mga mo graduate magtipid yun. Guys, hello guys, dagan kita kailan na graduation feast, toga, um, graduation picture, mga bills na need na to settle from school, sa school. So, I know na ang makeup during graduation kay wala na gina siya sa plan. No? So, for today, I'll be sharing some of the tipid, um, sort of tipid makeup look for those graduate things students so so yeah let's start first is our foundation guys for my foundation i use maybelline super stay um, it's around 400 pesos guys and barato na juk ayun na siya and mulo mo last good ang makeup nimo throughout the day and you can buy it sa sm department store sa watson's and any makeup um, stands sa atong mga mall. So, iblan ng ginatog tarang atong foundation, guys, para di gin taon ta magkabang kabang just the Lord. Kung di mo ganahan ma turn off inyong crush, guys, tarong nga git taon ng blend inyong foundation, apili inyong mga kalitli ugan ka important in taon na, guys. So, please lang, charot. So, after blending out our foundation, let's set our foundation with a loose powder. With me, I have my Nichido in the shade Ivory. I bought it from SM Department Store. It's around 150 pesos to 180, I guess. But, kung dili na jit kaisa budget, you can use any compact powder or any pressed powder you can use to set your foundation. It is important to set our foundation para in town, dili in town, ta mag sinaw. Dili madali ma ko ana atong foundation, di ba? So, important gyapon is to blend it properly kay para di in town ta magkabang ug dili in town magcake ang atong foundation So for the next step setting our under eye with a loose powder with me I'm still using the same powder the Nichido for baking or setting my under eyes with a powder to lessen the appearance of eye bags and to somehow lessen the appearance of the fallouts of the eyeshadows that I'll be putting in a while. So for our eyeshadow, since graduation day, look man ang atong ganahan i-achieve dili man pageant uh, makeup. So let's use some warm or earth or nude colors for our eyeshadow. So for me, I am currently using a light brown shade of eyeshadow and blending it with a lighter brown or a lighter eyeshadow. So guys, sa atong pag eyeshadow guys, dili yun like importante kung unsa nga eyeshadow imong gigamit or unsa nga brand sa eyeshadow imong gigamit. Naaragin na siya sa pag blend guys. So, it's better to blend, 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 blend lang yun ta guys. Until ma-achieve yun na to ang kanabitong gradient type na eyeshadow. So, blend blend lang kita guys. So, laban lang kita itong pag blend rin da pita guys. So, after blending out our foundation, let's move on with the eyeliner. So, guys, dili ra relasyon ang mag move on patinsad sa atong tutorial. So, for my eyeliner, I am currently using the Maybelline Tattoo Eyeliner. So, for this look, I am trying to achieve a not so winged eyeliner para dili kaayo ingon ana ka bungisyos atong eyeliner kay graduation day ro ba in town dili in town ni pageant atong giatanan guys so para mo binat lang gamay para chinita chinita ta gamay no so mag wing eyeliner ta very light for the next step is curling our eyelashes with a curl lash so guys pwede jud mo mo gamit bisag unsa nga brand sa curl lash and after curling our lashes let's put some mascara you can actually use different types or any brands of mascara as long as maka-volumize siya sa ato mga eyelashes. You can or you may not use false eyelashes for this look but 
Mas nindo kaya dito na eye falls ay lashes together with the curl lashes that you have. Next is to brush off the powder or the loose powder that we put under our eyes. So like what I've said earlier, iblend lang yun nato ng taman guys, kaya para nindo siya di siya magcake. So guys, for the eyeliner, I am currently using the same shade of eyeshadow for my eyeliner para fresh lang yun ang atong datingan o dili ta morag hogyard. So next is putting some false eyelashes on my lashes to create another volume since gamay juga ayo o mugbo kayo ang ako ang eyelashes guys so yeah so I need to use some false eyelashes to create drama and volume to my eyes so let's move on with the blush currently I am using a not so pink shade of blush to put and create colors on my cheeks so for this look for the day look or the graduation look, dili man taganahan nga. Grabe ka pink ato mga cheeks na murag putok na jug kaayo. So, for this look, minimal lang yun ang amount of blush on nga ato i-apply to create a very youthful, very fresh looking na makeup. So now for the lipstick, I am currently using a nude shade of lipstick to maintain that very youthful and very baby girl look na anahan na to achieve so at the same time let's avoid using any dark shade of lip lipstick para di sad taon ta murag ma overdressed sa ato ang makeup igabot na to sa atong venue sa atong graduation so better use any warm or nude color lipstick para ma maintain atong youthful looking na makeup lastly now for my key license Kilay is life, and di kumita babuhi gud mo like kilay nga on fix. So, for my kilay, since I have very, very baga na na kilay, so I'm trying to just make use of the kilay that I have. So, minimal rajud nga powder, brow powder, akong ibutang since na naman jud ko kilay daan, and put some brow gel afterwards to create that very bushy, bushy brow type nga atong ganai achieve. Thank you. 